Hello, my name is Nicole Barton and I'm the fair director for the other art fair Dallas and Los Angeles. And today I'm really excited to give you a quick tour preview of what to expect in the Barker Hanger Room for Global Virtual Edition Fair. So let me take a moment here to share my screen and we'll get started. So I'm going to take you through few highlights in this room and what you'll find inside I hope you'll be excited about. So first off, if you've never attended the other art fair in Los Angeles, this is kind of a, a version of what the Los Angeles fair looks like. Um, we're at Barker Hanger in Santa Monica, so we'll do a quick little virtual preview. So first, I want to take you to some exciting artists that I'm discovering for the first time, some of them today, and some are a few exhibitors I've actually worked with in the past. So this booth is by Angel Park, and I just really loved listening to her Meet the Others video. This is a great tool that you can use throughout the virtual fair. If you click on any of the videos of the artists, you can learn about their work and their practice as an artist in their own words. So that's a great resource to definitely check out. So Adrienne is based in South Korea and her work is really about positivity. She uses traditional Korean painting methods using a water-based pigment, um, which she grinds herself. So I wanna give you a look at some of the detail here in her work. Now, when you're navigating around the fair, you can click directly on under these works to kind of zoom in or learn more about it. Um, so as you can see, she's dealing with a lot of figurative work in the natural world, but also some interiors as well. Um, and I just love the subtlety and the delicacy of her colors and also the detail and fine work that you can see. She's obviously working um, very carefully and I think it's just beautiful work. So definitely want to check out, um, as you can see, these are largely focused on the natural world, but um, she is exploring sort of universal themes of family and positivity. Um, and I think that you'll find a closer examination will bring you a lot of joy as they do me. So moving on, I want to skip ahead to another artist who I've worked with before. Dawn Beckles is based in London and she's shown at many editions of the other art fair. So those of you who've never attended a fair before, um, this is a great way for you to discover one of our very popular artists. So Dawn's work, she's working in mixed media and a lot of what her work deals with is interiors, but also still lifes and even some portraiture. Um, she works with a very vibrant palette, as you can see, and the saturation of her colors is really gorgeous. So I particularly love the work she does with different types of vessels. Um, and one innovation in her work that I'm seeing for the first time in this fair is she's actually incorporating some human um, figures into her vessel works. So I'll quickly pan over here. You can just see the fantastic colors. She grew up in Barbados. So even though she's now based in London, you can definitely see nods to her childhood growing up in the vibrant, rich colors. Um, so these are the works I was alluding to. You can see in each of these works, she's got the still life with the vessel, but then she's got the hands holding these works. And I just really love this combination of introducing the suggestion of the human relationship there. And the one up here is probably one of my favorites. Just really vibrant and I just love her take on this. Okay, moving ahead, I want to point out another artist that we've worked with before named Jaime Dominguez. Jaime's works are an interesting combination of a love for modernism, architecture, and design. And also as an artist from Mexico, he's exploring a lot of indigenous culture, including you know, origins of colors and use of pattern, as well as the different types of herbs that are really important in Mexican and indigenous culture. So um, Jaime works in large scale with acrylic on canvas for the most part. 
He's also doing things across multimedia. media. So if you're familiar with Mexican design, you can see some of these patterns that you may recognize. So his brilliant use of colors is just something that I'm really drawn to. And I'm particularly excited to see his work in this fair because you can see he's got some new color combinations here. So really exciting work. And I definitely encourage everyone to check them out. Also in this room, we've got two of our new features learners. So I want to quickly jump ahead. One of these new features learners is Ishmael Warte. He is based in London. And as you can see, a lot of his work is inspired by graffiti, but also cartoons. And he draws inspiration from music and books as well. So he's exploring things to do with African diaspora, and he's exploring things through his work that he's learning about and also learning about himself as well. So he was one of the winners of our New Futures Award, which recognizes emerging talent. And we're really excited to have him there. So it's just incredible, love this work. Our last New Futures winner is an artist called Pachi Gosi, and I want to show you her work as well. She's working in really emotional, expressive, gestural works. She's based in London. And as you can see, she's exploring such vibrant colors and emotions in her work that are really striking and beautiful. She's originally from India and she calls London. So together, she and Ishmael are two of the artists, definitely not to miss in this room. <clears throat> now, as you're navigating through the fair, you can jump to all kinds of exciting features. There's a special room dedicated to the Museum of Crypto Art. So you'll be able to see some NFTs and special crypto works there. And I also want to point out the Bombay Sapphire booth. Bombay is one of the great partners of the fair, and they've done some really exciting things with us. So let me quickly navigate. So if you ever attended the other art fair, um, some of our editions, Bombay Sapphire has been a great partner, and they have sponsored some really exciting video content, including tutorials and workshops. So at the Sir Craig's Moody Bombay Sapphire Bar, you can learn how to make work or cocktails from home, guided by expert uh, mixologists. And also, if you're not familiar with Bombay, they draw a lot of inspiration uh, from their botanicals. So they're working with exotic botanicals from around the world. And we commissioned an artist called Eddie to create this beautiful mural here, which is also a live mural that is currently on view at our fair in Brooklyn. So um, we love working with Bombay and they definitely help to augment the experience of cooking cocktails and supporting artists around the world. So I will leave things there, but I wanna point out before you step away, um, we also have the Sachi Art booth where you can discover period collections and the discovery room is another great place to filter and um, find some works that you may be looking for, whether it's related to medium, price, style, size, all of that great stuff. So thank you so much for joining us and enjoy the fair. We look forward to seeing more of you online. And uh, thanks for joining us today. Take care.